And welcome back, everyone. Today, 27, I believe, or 28. I don't know. This event has been going for a very long time. Whatever day it is, welcome back to the Iguana Milling Challenge. Um, going to be a really short update today because I have to leave very early tomorrow morning to go to Texas. So I'll be in this room uh, tomorrow. You'll be able to see me on the stream. We've got a lot of prep to do because as I talked about earlier in the week, we're going to have to pause the event on Friday. Uh, Tsesha needs the machine back. The coin is still looking good uh, at 578 hours now. So it does not look like it's close to being done. So how this event goes further, we'll figure out. But for Friday, we'll have a nice little closing ceremony to this first chapter. So we've got a lot of prep there to do. I have a lot of announcements. Um, I thought I'd just quickly answer some questions that I've gotten in the chat and in email and on Instagram because uh, it might uh, help you. So first is, are you milling iguanas? We've got that on the chat. Uh, no, we're not milling iguanas. The iguana is this new coating. This is the tool line with this brand new coating uh, that we're showing. So we are not harming any animals in this live stream. Um, a lot of people ask, how long will the tool last? If you watch the opening, there was um, one of our partners, one of Sesh's partners from Diovac talked about uh, how many hours his customers there were getting. So if you missed that, go back and check it out, sesha.de. Um, were we nervous at the start? Several people wrote this. So I think it was clear if you watched the opening ceremony that we were all very nervous. Now that we're 578 hours into it, uh, everyone's far more relaxed. So I hope the closing uh, will go much smoother. Um, how long will the event go? A lot of, like I said, Friday, we're going to be pausing the event because the tool still looking like it can cut a lot more. So uh, we'll figure out if we'll have like once a month little live streams or if we send the tool someplace else to mill something else. We'll figure all of that out. Uh, if you have suggestions, write me. Uh, we're open for any good ideas. Um, are the tools available? A lot of people have asked. And yes, they are not yet live uh, in the portfolio, but they are live as pre-sale. Um, so at Tsesha in their shop, go to tsesha.de. You'll find information on how to get an account there. This is the 935 series, the Iguana. And under Alien Tools, so alien-tools.com, uh, you'll see it's under the Predator series. So it's the same tool, different branding. Um, last question, a lot of people ask this probably. Number one is how can they get a coin? Now, on Friday, we'll, we'll be announcing uh, that we'll be auctioning a couple off for charity. How to do that, how to participate, we'll tell more about on Friday. So uh, stay tuned for that. If you really want one of these coins, then there's going to be a couple that you can uh, buy for yourself for a good cost. So win-win. That's it for me. Uh, I will see you guys in Königsbachstein tomorrow. Until then, enjoy the stream. <laughs>